So here's an absolutely absurd Premiere error that I encountered. I've previously encountered problems with uh, horrible screeching noises, and I've also encountered problems with audio cutting out or audio not being properly synchronized uh, when it plays back. However, I have never encountered an audio problem as absurd as this. It seems to be taking bits of audio that is previously played and then playing them again when I'm trying to play another part of the timeline. So it'll keep repeating the same thing even though I'm somewhere else. So it's working normally right now. For cases made of wood and aluminum for the iPhone. And I think that's where it starts to go buggy. I'm going to make some changes. I'm, you know, I'm, I'm making this pre-roll here and I'm moving stuff around. And after I uh, move stuff around and make some changes, then it just goes completely off the rails. You're going to see here in a few seconds, it just starts playing completely the wrong audio. For the iPhone. Um, for the iPhone 5, so on for cases made of wood. For the iPhone 5, so on for cases made of wood. That is not the audio that's supposed to be being played there, by the way. And you see here, I'm trying to play other stuff, and I'm not getting any audio at all. And I'll let the rest of it speak for itself. Bumper cases made of wood. Bumper cases made of wood. Warning, it's about to get extremely loud. And at this point, I uh, decided that I need to save and just relaunch Premiere. I can't be doing this every single time there's a bug, but I have to. I don't really have a choice. And after this, it acted normally again. No idea what happened here. Keep in mind this was recorded with Shadowplay, so the audio won't necessarily be perfectly synchronized. V-cell cases are exquisitely... And that's it. That's the, uh, that's the bug. If you've had this problem too, I suggest you submit a bug report to Adobe, because I'm going to. I don't even know how to describe this. Uh, the horrible screeching is definitely a problem. The audio in Premiere just seems to be a whole lot worse in Premiere CC 2015. I have uh, CC 2015.0.2, so it's the latest version, and still have a lot of audio problems. And I'm going to be making a full video with all of those shortly.